Hey guys, John here and welcome to another episode of John Tries. Today we're looking at Jeopardy on the PS3. Never really done any sort of game show game on my channel. So this might be pretty interesting because I'm not particularly good at <laughs> trivia, but I'm checking out all these PS Now games and I thought, what the heck, uh, let me go over these things real quick. Alright, so I made myself a character, which ironically ended up looking just like Proton John's character in the Runaway Guy's Wheel of Fortune series. But the, all these games were made by the same company anyway, so it makes sense. Anyway, um, settings. Easy, enable mini games, use AI players, sure. We're gonna go with that because I'm probably going to be terrible otherwise. So yeah. This is Jeopardy. Yay. They're random stopping and starting with applause. Here I am. Oh man. And <laughs> now probably gonna get wrecked, aren't I? Jeopardy Alex Thank you, Johnny Gilbert, and thank you, ladies and gentlemen. That's good enough. Let's go. <laughs> the first round of play today has these categories okay. for you. Canada, Mexico, or the United States. Okay. Ancient history, 2006. Mm. Classic Jeez. novel spoilers. Okay. TV shows by Emmy winner. Ooh. Medicine. Ooh. And Mobilize. Okay. Player one, you start us off. Well, let's go... Um... Classic novel spoilers for 200, First Alex. Scientist creates monster that craves bride. Scientist makes and destroys bride. Scientist dies. Monster mourns. That's Here, Frankenstein, for sure. Yep. <laughs> Heck yeah. You get to pick again, player one. Let's Raskolnikov keep on going. Murders an old woman. Raskolnikov confesses and is sentenced to eight years in Siberia. Um, player one. I'm gonna say Anna Karenina. Ah, nope. oh, no! I just lost all my money. Anyone else care to try to come up with a correct response? No. We're talking about crime and punishment. Ah, oh, whatever. Select again. Constance marries paralyzed Sir Clifford, has an affair with the gamekeeper, gets pregnant, awaits divorce and new life. Let's hear it, player one. <sighs> I wish I hadn't said anything. Sorry, that's I'm terrible. Anyone else? Why did I even ring in? I had no clue. Um, in. Are they gonna ring in? Oh, okay, she did. <laughs> she got it wrong too, though. Anyone else want to hazard a guess on this? I mean, there's only one left, so. Yeah. Let's hear it, player three. Good. <laughs> Should have known. Where do we begin, player three? She's just gonna keep it going. Is raised in the Earnshaw home. Oh, I know this one. Calls for Kathy. Love thwarted. Both die. Got it. Let's hear it, player one. That is. Wait, is it Pride and Prejudice or Wuthering Heights? Heathcliff. Wuthering Heights. Good. You're out of the hole. Out of the hole. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> Where do we begin? <laughs> Itinerant workers George and Lenny dream of owning a ranch. Lenny accidentally kills a girl. George. Oh, I know this one. Um. Yes, 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 yes. It's player one. This is uh, of mice and men. Right. right, I'm in the lead. Heck yeah. Turn to you, player one. Okay. Uh, we're go we're gonna go. 
My favorite category. We're gonna go ancient history. In February, he shot Harry Whittington, not his intended target. Player two. I should have known that. Why didn't I think of that? All right, let's get back into this. Wait, right, she's going for Canada, Mexico. In area. Yes, player one. Would be the United States. No, no wait, Canada, Mexico. Anyone else want to hazard a guess on this? Canada's bigger, isn't it? Dang it! Yes, player two. I think about that. Why didn't I think about that? I'm an idiot. Two. Back to you for our next selection. It's ninety percent Catholic. That's got to be Mexico. Yes, player one. Right. Okay. We got this. Player we got one. this. Where do we... the most populous? That is the United States for sure. It's player one. You got it. Okay. We're on a roll now. We're on a roll. These are so easy, and yet I'm still struggling with some of them. It has two official languages. Okay. That's going to be Canada, because it's French and English. Okay. Back to you. We're rolling now. By an emperor from 1864 to Pretty sure that's Mexico. Right, we have a big lead now. Player one, back to you. All right, let's get back to 2006. Discovery, and this legendary space shuttle went aloft. Okay. Yes, player one. It's the Endeavor. Sorry, no. Anyone else want to hazard a guess on this? <laughs> Why am I so dumb? John is dumb. Confirmed. Okay, when it comes to two. trivia, anyway. You are correct. Hey, you're on the plus side. I didn't know that. Two. You start. You staying in this one, okay? In November, an Andy Warhol work depicting this Asian leader sold for more than $17 million. I'm not going to try. I have Let's no idea. Player three. Yes. <laughs> I would not have guessed that, I'm sure. A lot of clues, a lot of categories, player three. Make us a this famous American passed away the day after Christmas at the age of 93. I'm going to try for this. Yes, player one. 2006. I'm going to say George Burns. Oh, that's incorrect. Anyone else want to hazard a guess? On this? <laughs> Must have been Gerald Ford. It's player two. Sorry, that's wrong. Yeah, it's Gerald Ford. Dang it. Anyone else want to hazard a guess on this? She'll get it. Freaking trying to catch me <laughs> in money. Oh my gosh, she's up to 2,000. Choose again. Oh, she didn't finish 2,000. Oh, I, I, I think I know this one. Yes, player one. Ah, uh, damages. Yeah. Good. Okay, I'm actually going to go finish Ancient History 2006. He led the French team to the finals of Soccer's World Cup, only to be ejected after headbutting an Italian player. Okay, this could be risky, but I think it's Zidane. Okay. Uh, TV shows by anyone? Yeah, might as well. Alec Baldwin. Oh, what was the name of that show? I'm going to ring one. in just for the heck of it. 30 Rock. Yep. We're rolling now. We're rolling. <laughs> um, oh my gosh, a Daily Double. This is terrifying. This is terrifying. Enter a wager amount. Um, I'm going to do 1,000. I'm not gonna go crazy. I wish I had. I should have bet it all. I should have bet it all. 
We return to you, Player One. 2011, Juliana Margulies. Uh, I'm not going to answer this one because I don't know. It's Player Three. Right. Yeah! Okay. Player Three, you start us off. 2004, Cynthia Nixon. Cynthia Nixon. Mm -mm, not ringing a bell. Player Please three. get it wrong. Good. <laughs> no, she's catching me again. Frick Please you. Again, player three. Medicine. Oh, this is bad. Longer than a week may indicate inflammation of these air spaces in the skull. Oh, I know this. All too well. Let's hear it, player one. Sinuses. That's correct. I have sinus problems all the time. Player one. <laughs> I'm very. Very aware. I'm actually going to check out mechanical device used to indicate musical tempo. Um, metronome. Right. Okay, we got something going here. Let's go. Player one, choose again. I'm gonna stick with this one. Agaric is one of these spore-producing fungi of the Basidiomycetes class. Let's hear it, player two. Player two, you're going to get out of the hole, maybe? Right you are. He's working on it. <laughs> Where do we begin, player two? Uh. It can be a powerful person in entertainment or a member of a Muslim dynasty that once ruled India. Okay. Player one? Mahara Mogul. Let's go see Maharaja. Okay. Nice. Player one, start it. Yeah, let's go. Someone who moves from relationship to relationship is a serial one. Okay. okay. Player one? Is this Marrier? A misogynist? It's not monogamous. No, Wait, it is, because that relationship to relationship, not all at the same time. God dang it. So it is monogamous. Please don't get it. Please don't get it, player three. Good. Here's what we wanted. A monogamous. Yeah, all right, whatever. It's fine. I lost player some money, but... Pick again, please. This large tube-shaped pasta is often stuffed with cheese... Oh, and yeah. ...tomato sauce. Manicotti. Let's hear it, player one. Ah, yeah. Correct. <laughs> all right, so that made us back some money. One. Pick again. The air puff test, a measure of eye pressure, is used to diagnose this condition. Oh, um, I know this, I know this, I know this, yes, I know this. Glaucoma? Yes. Good. That was good. That was a thousand right there. All right. You get to pick again, player one. A Keep going up. Is a tube often used to hold these open, especially... Oh, right, right, right. This is, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's um, player one. Artery. Artery or valve? Valve. No. no. Anyone? Artery. Dang it. <sighs> so dumb. So tell me, except for certain things. Please don't get it. Please don't get it. Yes. Here's okay. the response we were looking for. Arteries. Yeah, 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 yeah. We got it. Move on, Alex. Please pick again, player one. Suspect Rocky Mountain spotted fever, even in patients from the Carolinas, as it's an area with lots of these critters. Player two. Ticks, of course. I should have thought of that. Hey, she's out of the hole, finally. And we'll Good for her. The board with this clue. All right, here with the clue is Sarah. Red blood cells are distorted into a particular shape and don't carry oxygen well in patients with this type of anemia. I'm not going to risk it. I don't want to lose any money. Here's the correct response. Sickle cell. All right. Player two, you're going first in the double jeopardy round when we return. All right, double jeopardy time. I've got a I've got a nice lead, but not as much as I would hope for. All right, here we go. Double Jeopardy. Anatomy and medicine. Oh yes. Cooking class. The scintillating 
seventeen hundreds. <laughs> what I really want to do is direct. Hmm. And literary country settings. Hmm. All right, let's get back into this. Player two has control. He designed titles for silent films before he made us scream over birds. Ah, Alfred Hitchcock. Let's hear it, player one. That's right. Way to go. That was easy, though. Player one, you start. Ah, uh, we'll stick with this. Years sure. before directing Batman and Robin, he had been a costume designer for Woody Allen, Christopher who Nolan. encouraged him to direct. Player one. Wait. Batman and Robin. No, that's Tim Burton. Oh, no, it was Christopher Nolan. Anyone else? Oh, Tim Burton did Batman Returns. That was the one that he did. Dang it. Okay, player I couldn't remember which one had the penguin in it. Sorry, that's Wait, it wasn't Christopher Nolan either. Anyone else want to have a guess? Well. <laughs> it's player 3. You <laughs> I was going to get that wrong either way. Player 3, you start. All right, whatever. This dancer and choreographer turned director for the Broadway musical Redhead, which starred Gwen Verdon. I don't even have a clue. Hopefully she doesn't get this player three. It'll be catching me in no time. Here's what we were looking for, Bob Fosse. Fosse, I don't know. <laughs> Whatever. This playwright gave Jessica Lang a big role when he directed the film Far north. Maybe he was a fool for love. I honestly don't know. These are too hard for me. I'm not smart. <laughs> Especially about Here's plays. We were looking for. Sam Shepard. Sam Shepard. I would have had no idea. This is Where this is not going well. I need to be making money. It's the third largest Hawaiian island. Oahu. Okay, player one. Right? That's right. I can't believe Omaha was on there. Is that pretty sure that's not a Hawaiian island? We... Let's take it over to Sarah. Two atoms of this element create a stable bond. When three of them bond, they form the unstable ozone molecule. Oxygen. Player one. Right. Right. <laughs> you again, player one. It's the here in an IPO. A corporation's first attempt to sell stock to the public. Um. It's player one. Overture? That's not it. That hurt. Anyone else? That was 1,200 freaking bucks. I shouldn't have. Probably offer. Player two. That's correct. It's offering, yeah. Plus. Dang it, why did I say overture? Player two, you start. Stupid. Uh oh. The treasure of the Sierra Madre, nineteen twenty-seven. Oh. Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know this. Okay, player one. Mexico. Yeah. Okay. Player one, you start. Let's try again. Steppenwolf. I wanna say like Germany, but Let's hear it, player three. That yes! is Dang it, I should have went for it. No, she's gaining on me. Three, you're in command of ah! we continue right now. Did she really just get the daily double? Frick you, player three. You're in second right now. Player oh three. my gosh. Please don't get this right. Walk about 1959. You are now in first place. No! <laughs> You again, player three. Freak player three. The Jewel in the Crown, 1966. Uh, I'm going to try. Yes, player one. The Jewel in the Crown. India. Hey, you're right. <laughs> Where do we begin, player one? Uh, let's go back to the O's. Oh, my freaking gosh. <laughs> what am I going to do? The second daily double. And you're in the lead now. How much? Uh, I'm pretty good at the O's, so I'm going to say 3,000. 
This is dumb, isn't it? All right, here's your clue. To use the razor named for this 14th century English philosopher. Oh, I should have done more. Economy and explanation. Occam's. Occam's razor. You have maintained your lead. I should have went for more. Player one. Okay. Again. I'm gonna do all again. Total solar eclipse is an example of this from the Latin for conceal. Okay. Yes, player one. Ob uh, obscuration, obstruction, oculations, obscuration. Sorry. What? Anyone else want to hazard a what? guess on this? No. Trick you. Don't answer it. Or let player two answer it. Okay. Here's what we were looking for. An occultation. Whatever. You can't even say it we return properly. To Frick one. you. <laughs> um, let's look at no these, I guess. As an artist himself, Julian Schnabel directed the 1996 film about this Haitian-American graffiti artist. No idea. <laughs> no. Please don't. I hate you, player three. Oh, she got it wrong. Yes. Anyone else? That means I'd have a one in two chance of getting this right. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to risk it. Here's the response we were looking for. Jean-Michel Basquiat. No idea. Player one, back to you. The Stranger. 19. The Stranger. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Um. Here's the correct response. Algeria. Yeah, I, I couldn't place it. Select again. Okay. Uh, gonna try something new. Let's go cooking class. If you boil these before making them into hash browns, they'll stick together better. Really? They'll cook faster, too. Really? You're gonna go from super hard okay, things to one. potatoes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Player one, pick again. Keep going. To make bunny salad, use a chilled pear half for the bunny's body, and a ball of cottage cheese for this appendage. The ears. Or no, the it, tail. One. Right. Good. Cause the cotton tail, yeah. Made we sense. return to you, player one. Joy okay. of cooking suggests using these Thanksgiving berries in any recipes. Cranberries. You like cranberries? Player one. <laughs> right. Okay. We have more than double player we three's money you, now. One. So the this is good. The website suggests making enchiladas with the Tuna. type of this. This is really easy category. Player one. That's it. This is a really easy category right now. You again, player one. For Keep it going. Dollar type of these breakfast treats, drop the batter onto the griddle one tablespoon. I love these. Tiny, tiny player pancakes. One. Yes. Tiny, tiny pancakes. They're very good. Player one, choose again. Okay, now we just have to hope they don't make enough money throughout oh, it's this. A network of nerves like the solar one. Player three? Sorry, that's <laughs> Any other takers? Actually. Yes, player one. Solar plexus, solar corona. Nope. Solar pl I didn't know solar plexus was a network of nerves. I thought that was just the area around your Midsection. Well, I guess that's why it hurts, right? The nerves you get hit in the solar plexus. Ah, dang it. All right, my bad. You're in command of the board, as we could Oh no, really? Future King George II lost his marbles over Henrietta Howard, and gave her Marble Hill House on this river. I have no idea. Yes, player three. Good for you. <laughs> Player three, you start us off. Okay. Nephrology is a medical specialty concerned with these organs.
Okay, player two. That's it. <laughs> Not my strong suit. Okay, let's get I just want to ride this out and hopefully the next have the lead. It's also called the auditory tube, and when it's blocked, mm. a can result. Gotcha. I can do this one. Okay, player one. It is the Eustachian tube, right? Or Philip it's Eustachian. That's it. I've had issues with Player that. One, make a selection, please. <laughs> On the Greek for bad mold, it's an abnormal growth of tissue or bone. Dogs get it in their hips. Oh. No. The correct response is dysplasia. Okay. I didn't have a clue. It's Player fine. One, <laughs> these five bones make up the palm of the hand. Uh, I'm gonna try to answer yes, this. Metacarpal. That is correct. I've been watching a lot of Bones, that show. Please pick again. One of my favorite shows of all time now that I've been binge watching it for the last couple of months, and I've learned a lot about Bones. Anyway, uh, sure. The famous one of these, Marie Camargo, is remembered for shortening her skirts to calf length. Famous one of these. I mean, model? I don't know. Okay, player two. I'm not. No. Diva? Anyone else? Well, since there's only two options left, I'll try. One. Ballerina? No. Painter? Ballerina's always had short skirts, right? So, painter. Sorry. Ballerina's always had like two twos, right? The frick. Player three. That's correct. Whatever. Player three. Where do Get we on start? with it. <laughs> In 1752, suave seducer Sergei Saltikov spiced up the life of this future empress. Not even gonna try. Hopefully, player three doesn't get it. Nobody. We're talking about Catherine the Great. Yeah, good for her. <laughs> I have no idea. Choose again. Come on. Born into a family of actors, he was expelled from a seminary. Big surprise. Before finding fame as a lusty libertine. I feel like I should know it, but I don't. Yes, player two. Yes. <laughs> Casanova. Wow. And the $2,000 clue? Here's Jimmy from our Clue Crew with the clue. clue An crew. engraving of this 18th century French monarch, America's most powerful ally during the Revolution, hangs at Mount Vernon. I'm going to regret one. this. Louis the 14th, Louis the 17th, Louis the 16th. It's the 14th. No. Darn it! No! Any other takers? It's fine. I still have a big lead. The 16th, wasn't it? Of course you would get it. Oh, she got it wrong. So it is the 16th. Come on, player two. There's only one option left. You might as well get you some money. Actually, she'll be second now. It is Louis the 16th. All right. You all move on to Final Jeopardy, which will continue. I've got a big lead. I can't be beat, so I'm not even gonna bet anything. I literally can't be beat. The category. Landmarks. Okay. Please enter your wager. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm. Not, I'm not gonna bet anything. Well, I'll bet thirty-eight dollars. The final Jeopardy clue <laughs> is as follows. The landmark site known to the Lakota as Six Grandfathers was renamed this after a prominent lawyer. Six Grandfathers was renamed this after a prominent... Oh. Well, I mean, Mount Rushmore sounds right because of the heads up there but Lakota Indians wouldn't have known about that I'm gonna say Pike's Peak 
you come up with the correct response? And this correct response will add one month Oh well. Score. I thought it, but then I said nah. And your response? Everybody know about John. I mean, I knew it, but it sounded wrong because of the Indian thing, so I thought, nah. And that will lose you. I still won! By a lot, so frick you, even though it's on easy and I missed a lot of questions. <laughs> Alright guys, thank you guys so much for watching me play Jeopardy! If you'd like to see me play it again sometime, let me know by hammering that like button, sharing with friends, subscribe for you to join the Wolfpack. And maybe we'll check it out again. But until then, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.